one. What's up, guys? It's Suicide of Mice, and uh, yeah, back on Amnesia with hey. uh, Joe again, obviously. Hello. Yeah. Um, let's jump right into this. Yeah, let's jump into this bad boy. Into the creepy tunnel again. Yeah. I don't like this game. It scares the shit out of me. So I have to um, chuck this limb into the water and just wait for it to start eating. Because I'm still stuck on the the bit with the second water creature. Oh, of course you are. Yeah, you got to chuck the limb in. Well, I'm in quite a nice little calming place. This is it's quite nice. This is oh very nice. God, I'm already scared again. Good. Yeah, you got to chuck the limb in, and when it actually starts eating the limb, you can turn the little rotary thing. It's not eating it. It will. Just throw it. Just throw another bit in the water. <gasps> oh my god. <laughs> I'm getting scared just by a few doors moving about. I chucked it pretty close to me. I have a feeling I'm gonna have to just die and do this again. Right. Storage. I'm not going to the storage. Fudge that. God. Guest room. I just pretty much killed myself. Go, 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 go. Oh my god. Oh, is that a dead bot? Jesus. Oh. I think I did it, Dan. I think I did it. Wait, did you? Are you on a loading screen? No, I got through that door. Oh, nice one. I'm just playing about with a little fountain. Woohoo! It's oh, locked just with a simple lock. Oh, yeah, there should be like a little thing. I think it's a hollow needle. You should find it on a shelf just on the left side of the room. Oh, I see what you mean. Double click on that and then use it on the door. Thank you, Dan. You are my saviour. So, um, basically, last time, I got too scared to play, I think. Yeah. I didn't want to die. I really didn't. Trust me, the next fix. <laughs> yeah. Just you wait. Woo! Go me. Go me. I did it. I did it. Are you on a loading screen now? Yeah. Alright, now just run. Got through. Run. What do you mean, run? Run. <laughs> Don't say that. Um. I'm running. Run. And close the doors behind you. Close? I'm not, I'm not closing the doors. I'm just running. Whoa! big room right now. Um, holding screen at the moment. Playing some pretty dramatic music though. Oh, did you have a good day today, Dan? Yeah, it was right. I just sat about playing Minecraft and a uh, bit of Counter-Strike and some Black Ops, which I completed today. Oh, the campaign. Yeah. Oh, that was a bit of an obvious twist though. Spoiler alert to anyone that hasn't completed it. I'm pretty sure the people who play Black Ops would have completed campaign yeah, by this now. Is <laughs> it's the first time I've completed it and I've had the game for like two years or however long it's been out. This is a strange looking fountain. Yeah. So, are you in this big room, Dan? Did you wait yeah. for me? Yeah, I waited. you got to go on the left, by the way. Yeah, I'm just yeah. going to have a little explore round. 
Have you looked around? Have you seen? Have you found yeah. anything in this room? No, not really. But um, I found a chest. To go, the door that opened, you need to go into. There's two tinder boxes and oil in a chest. What chest? Where? Uh, as you go out up from the stairs, turn right, and there's a chest in the corner. Oh yeah, so there is. Thank you. Um. But yeah, so it sounds like you had a pretty chilled out day today. What did you get up to today? I went to see um, Hannah, my girlfriend, today. Still not a Facebook official though. Oh well, it's cool. It's because I'm married to Callum on Facebook. The horse then? Um, I don't know if I could do that to him. I'm sure he'll be fine. Guest room. I can go yeah. in the guest room. I'd advise going in the door on the left first. Okay, I was just having a little explore. No, I had a good time today. Although I have to go back to college tomorrow, which kind of sucks. Yeah. I'm lucky, Chuggy. You have an ascending room. Will it take us to the inner sanctum? It will definitely take it's care of working. the vertical part of our journey. It's not worth So, you have ridden an elevator before? Find a way to start the engine. Yes, the, the Colosseum, a Regent's Park has one. It takes you to the gallery where you can view the panorama. Good. Mm. Maybe this the machine room? Be a little longer. And in the oh, other you're in a cutscene. Okay, so, um... They have an elevator. Yep. And I'm guessing it's going to be broken because um, I, s I turned left and I saw a machine room. Yeah, you need to click on the uh, elevator there, otherwise it won't work. But I don't think you'd be able to. It's not working. Kind of obvious. Find a way to start the engine that powers the elevator. I'm going to go in the machine room. I think oh. I'll go in the machine room as well. Fail. No, I won't. <laughs> Find the key. Find the key that unlocks the door leading to the machine room. Right, okay, should we go? The guest room, the storage room, or the other one? Study. Um, seeing as we are, uh, we're guests in this castle. Let's go to the or guest room. At least I assume so. Let's go to the guest room, and then maybe once once we get more acquainted, we can congregate in the study. You're using words that I don't even understand, my friend. You do understand them, you just don't know it yet. Whoa! Ow! Quite like. Um, this is pretty peaceful at the moment, to be honest. After that little water bit. My journal is gone. As our good friend EUBOTHD HD would say. She's out! <laughs> oh, tinderbox. Oh, there's a cupboard. I'm just um, glad there's light in here. Yeah, same. Whoa! Mouse is spazzing. Oh, there's a note on the table. Oh, it's a biggie one. A speaky note. Where did you find the tinder box? On the mantelpiece on the left room. Oh, okay. I'll go in there after I read this note. 2nd of July, 1839. I received a letter today from the Algerian governor's office disclosing the fate of Herbert's expedition. About a week after my departure, Abdullah, one of the men traveling with us, Abdullah. returned from the desert. He was badly injured. The French quickly dispatched a search party. The man rambled deliriously about the expedition being attacked by something horrible. Oh, the French intense. quickly dispatched a search party to look for the expedition. After Easy. searching for days, they found the camp abandoned without any trace of Herbert or his men. Are you worried for him? Tomorrow, Ooh, a crowbar. I'll retrieve the things they Sweet. recovered from Herbert's tent at the castle. You get to bash some skulls then. I don't know what to make of it, but I'm worried for him. Right then. Oh, there's a note on this table too. Daniel's worried. I swear, yeah. I keep a... Oh, it's a bug. I thought I kept on hearing like a, s like a snake, but I think it may have been the bug. Yeah. Uh. 
some nice clothes. I know, right? That's <laughs> what I'm wearing to work. When are you going to work? Thursday. Thursday, who? You're looking forward to it? A bit nervous. I'm sure you'll be fine. What are you, um, at your store, stock room? Yeah, I'm a stock room assistant. Third of July. Hold on, I'm in the middle of a note. Same. Today I picked up Herbert's things at the customs house. I dug through the trove of documents he had carried and found a log detailing the expedition. The nature of this text ranged from quick notes to colourful accounts of transpired events. I skimmed the pages trying to figure out what might have happened. May 17th, the day I was trapped inside the orb chamber, Herbert dryly states, recovered Daniel after one hour of entrapment. This confused me greatly. I was suffocating within minutes. Jesus. How could I have Shit lasted is going down hour? in this castle. I continued reading the peculiar text. Herbert states his facts without judgment or passion. But suddenly, I could read frustration into his text. He pushed his men to investigate the underground tomb, an effort which oh, seems to have strained the minds of his men. Madness spread through the ranks, and Herbert had to take some extreme measures to continue. He finally visits the chamber himself, where he retrieves the orb to the surface. His account confuses me greatly. If he has the orb... I've noticed there's a lot of bottles in this room. I think we were being, like, drunks all the time. There's a lot of bottles with blood pools underneath them. Maybe there was just a big old bar fight going on. Or a bedroom fight. <laughs> Pillow fight got out of hand. Yeah. Someone mistook a glass bottle for a pillow. The yeah. the door is stuck due to a broken lock. All these doors seem to be locked. Oh, have you got um a crow the crowbar from that room? Yes. I think we should use that on this bad boy. Oh, let's hope it works. Oh, I've got no oil. Yeah, it definitely works. The key. Please, let it be here. Whoa! Yeah, son. An important key is hidden in the guest room. Well, that's good. Because I'm in the guest room. Oh, yeah. Oh, there's a note. It's done. 4th of July, 1839. It's oh. done. The orb is assembled. I was awakened by an exhausting nightmare. Shaking and sweating, mm. I retired to the drawing room with a cup of tea. <laughs> many pieces lay spread across El the Grey. Room as I'd left them. But somehow, <laughs> I knew how it was supposed to be. I fetched the tar, which I had prepared to fix the pieces together, and without fault, I joined them, producing the orb I remembered so clearly. The tar proved unnecessary. It was pushed out from the joining pieces as they oh, merged on their means. own, with no adhesive. The ancient stone relic now rests on my table. Its immaculate surface and perfect shape could have been molded by a factory. This is, this is well weird, bro. Too strange. Very odd. How strange. It could have been molded by a factory. Uh, I just got a. You better find a place to hide. <gasps> what the fuck is that? What the fuck is that? Okay, okay, I'm getting in the cupboard. Get in the cupboard. I'm in the cupboard, man. Oh, as soon Jesus. as it said find a place to hide, I got in the cupboard. I can hear something. I can hear something too. Just let's be quiet for a moment, Dan. Let's have a quiet moment and contemplate our lives before we meet our miserable end. Stop creaking around my room. I'm gonna come out there and slap you. I can hear it, man. I can hear it. I can hear it too. Are you crouching? No. I'm, I'm I've crouching. Got the door slightly open, so I can see if anything comes in here. Oh, mine's um completely closed. <laughs> okay, I think it's gone. I don't want to go out. I could see Neither do I. Should we just chill in the cupboard for a while? That was shit scary, son. 
Well, oh the cupboard God. kind of mutated a bit, and then it just said, "Find a place to hide." <laughs> he's that? not in. Oh, he's not in the other cupboard, is he? I don't want to open the bloody cupboards. <laughs> <laughs> he's just gonna be sitting there. Surprise!